Start a dropshipping business today. A 2024 dropshipping guide. You're officially ready to start your dropshipping journey. How to start dropshipping. In the last couple years of dropshipping. The past few years, I've managed to make over seven figures dropshipping. The same layout that generated me over $3 million this year alone in 2023. So it's around halfway through the day and I've already generated around $3,800 in sales on this store. When it comes to making money online, you can't go 10 seconds without this word popping up like it's on every successful finance creator's lips. A business model where you find a product and sell it at a markup price, but without having to handle the shipping yourself. Even top creators outside of finance also practice some form of dropshipping. You find your creators advertising goods like branded shirts to their viewers, but are nowhere directly involved in the shipping. And that site, of course, is where you'll find the new merch. And we've refreshed the entire MKBHD merch store. That's where you'll find all this stuff. And by the way, we're graduating from more than just apparel, so. A third party handles the manufacturing, packaging, and delivery. The creator only just gets the word out and sometimes creates the online store. So the saying that you can make $100,000 monthly with dropshipping is true, but yes, there's a but. So I decided to challenge myself and go back to my roots and start a dropshipping business from scratch with no idea what I'm going to sell, with no idea how I'm going to sell it. How can you make this money without being a big influencer? How can you achieve dropshipping success while spending as little as possible? Is it even possible to get to $100,000 as a beginner? I'm Ty late and isn't the market already saturated? All these questions run through many people's minds, probably running through your mind right now. And Vlad, not so long ago, wondered the same. He always wanted to make money at a young age, trying everything from working multiple jobs to grinding for followers on Instagram. And just like most people, he found little success. Vlad, however, managed to grow multiple Instagram pages to reach thousands of followers, getting him access to Shoutcat, a service that connected Instagram influencers to advertisers. It was here that Vlad learned about dropshipping. Most of Vlad's clients paid him to promote products, with some paying him as much as $40 per post. Vlad wanted to know what it was all about and why these people were paying him to advertise, so he dove deep. After his deep dive, Vlad went on to explore dropshipping, which allowed him to sell products without having to handle shipping. Paid advertising was one of the two popular advertising models people predicted. Vlad liked it, and he was sold. Without any time wasted, Vlad hopped in searched for a product in the beauty niche, the Lash Enhancement Serum, and ran with it. He did everything. He opened a Shopify store and quit one of his jobs to create time for managing his store. He was confident that this would be his big break. He made promotional videos, posted them on his channel, and paid other Instagram influencers to promote his product. The result? Vlad got an order 24 hours in. He was excited and paid for more advertising. When the dust settled and the excitement wore off, Vlad balanced his books. He had barely broken even. Advertising had been a huge chunk of his expenses. A month after getting into dropshipping, Vlad closed down his Shopify store but learned two valuable lessons. If he had a better product, and more importantly, didn't spend so much on advertising, he'd have a moneymaker on his hands. Remember Vlad's Instagram pages? Yes. He decided to create multiple pages in the beauty niche, hoping to one day use them to promote his own dropshipping products. Given that Vlad already had five years of experience growing pages, it didn't take long to reach thousands of followers on multiple of his pages. He started taking shout out orders on these pages, making over $2,000 monthly from promoting posts. More importantly than making money, Vlad was also gaining experience. By promoting other people's products, he could use it to learn what works and what doesn't. Almost a year later, Vlad decided to go back into dropshipping. He created a new store around one of his clients' best performing products. However, midway through his setup, Vlad randomly stumbled on a new product. He instantly knew this was going to be a hit, so much so that he scrapped all previous plans and created a new campaign around this new product. The product in question was the famous teeth whitening pen. Vlad created videos reviewing the product and posted them across his pages. The very first day, he made over $500, and that month, he made over $33,000. He knew he had to upscale, so he paid friends to act in his videos, paid Fiverr freelancers, and paid other pages for advertising. That month, Vlad hit his first $100,000.
he'd go on to make over a million dollars that year. Vlad is a YouTuber, Biahiza. He made a million dollars at the age of 18, not bad at all. Let's say you want to be like Vlad and make thousands of dollars with dropshipping, but you do not know how to set up a Shopify store, or you are not confident in your ability to build a professional looking store, or you need someone to create review videos for the products you want to promote. Then look no further than Fiverr.com. On Fiverr, you can find freelancers who will provide you quality service from building your Shopify store to creating engaging posts or even setting up and managing your Google, Bing, or Facebook ads to push your products you are trying to promote. If you have money, but not a lot of time, like me, then Fiverr is a place you want to go. And Fiverr is offering my viewers a special deal. If you sign up on Fiverr using the first link in the description, you can get 10% off your first purchase. Now, what if you are trying to start a dropshipping business, but you don't have anywhere near the funds to keep up with advertising costs? hosting payments, or even know what products you want to sell. You don't have the experience that Biahiza had. How then do you achieve success? This situation is where Howard found himself. He knew he could make it, in his head at least. In his head, the internet was a sea of gold and all he had to do was to reach out and grab it. So how could he find a product that would capture the audience's attention and avoid spending valuable money in advertising costs? Howard had a couple of options one of which was to find another business model, take a loan or find a business partner who would fund the advertising while Howard focuses on making the business profitable. It was while Howard was still pondering how to get a winning product and add money that he came across a third solution, one that would help him find the perfect product and eliminate the need to take a loan or even find a business partner. And that method was growing organically. Something that if you have tried, you might consider tedious. But this is not always the case, especially if you find yourself providing content that is not already saturated. This model, if done right, cuts away the need for paid advertising almost entirely and means you can get into dropshipping while spending the barest minimum and still achieve success. One way to grow organically is by using the Bonner method. This involves creating Bonner Instagram and TikTok accounts to follow top affiliate marketing pages. You engage with the accounts as much as you can, and before long, the algorithm will start showing you rising products. After which, you create campaigns around these viral products and post them on your social media accounts. Howard did exactly this, and it was super effective. Barely a week into creating his Bonner account, he found the ultimate product, a viral Instagram video of Thor's Hammer. This wasn't just a novelty piece but a toolbox shaped to look like the real deal. Howard was 100% sure that people would love it. But which people? This question right here is where most aspiring dropshippers fail. They want to target the right audience. They try to target everyone. What you need to do instead is to target the right audience. If you try to cast a wide net at everyone, the chances are you end up catching no one. Howard knew the answer. Dads. He was going to target fathers. However, he wouldn't do this head on. He'd present this as the ultimate gift for dads who loved Marvel movies. And as luck would have it, Father's Day was right around the corner. Howard had his product. All he needed now was a website and free advertising. For the former, he went to Shopify. Howard didn't have the money to make his website look fancy. And quite frankly, he didn't need to. He only needed a simple page that showed pictures of the product and briefly highlighted its durability and functionality. So Howard picked one of the Shopify's multiple free packs. Now, advertising. Howard didn't have any cash to pay for advertising, so he did the next best thing. Leverage all the big social media platforms. If you can't sacrifice your cash, then the only other thing you can sacrifice is your time. Howard ordered the product, made a short clip, added captions, and uploaded the clip to Instagram. YouTube Shorts, and TikTok. These three are absolute gems for going viral overnight. The videos got decent views, with the most reaching 106,000 views. This wasn't enough, so Howard doubled his efforts. A smart trick many people use for these user-generated content videos is to change the first frame in the video to make a new one. So, you can have multiple clips from a single video that barely took you 10 minutes to create. Howard used this trick while also trying out different captions for each video. One morning, he woke up to his iPhone blowing up with notifications. One of his videos had gone viral, going up to 4 million views. On that day, Howard made his first $5,000 in sales. The following week, 
another video joined the viral train with 40 million views. And in less than two months of starting his dropshipping endeavor, Howard had hit the 100,000 revenue mark. Who is Howard? He is no other than the 19-year-old YouTuber Cameron. These two stories prove one thing. You need a winning product and advertising avenue to achieve success in dropshipping. You can find products on sites like AliExpress and Amazon or use the burner method to know which untapped products may catch people's attention. Loads of people are making millions with dropshipping and you too can join the train as it's never too late to enter the space. Maybe you don't want to take the dropshipping route of creating a store. Or maybe you just want to handle the phase of getting information about the product out to the public and getting paid for your efforts. This is affiliate marketing and you might be curious which is better or more profitable, affiliate marketing or dropshipping. This video right here on the screen compares these two business models with stories of real life people that have achieved success in both these domains. With information from this video, you would absolutely know which you should delve into. The video is super packed with information and I'm sure you would love it. Click it now and I'll see you there. Thanks for watching.